I also don't know how I got Radhika. So I am definitely the most uh, luckiest here. I would say I have earthquakes and tsunami is going in my heart when I see Radhika. I have faced many health crises since childhood, but my father and mother have never let me feel that I have suffered. Thank you, Mama, for all that you've done, Mama. That all this is created by my mother and no one else. And my mother has gone all out for the last four months. She's worked for, I think, 18, 19 hours a day. And I'm extremely grateful to Mama and thank you so much. Uh, I'm. I would like to thank each and every one of you present here. I know everyone has made it to Jamnagar to make me and Radhika feel special. We are all honored and humbled to have all of you here. I am sorry if I have called if we if we have caused any inconvenience to anyone. Please do forgive us both the families. So uh, I hope everyone is going to enjoy the coming three days and I would just like to thank my mother, my father, my sister and my brother, my sister-in-law, brother-in-law for making uh, this event so memorable for me and Radhika. I think my family has gone all out to make us feel special. Everyone has been sleeping for less than three hours a day for the last two, three months. And it's extremely, uh, I'm, I'm so happy that I can share this joy with everyone out here. Uh, I really don't have words to express my gratitude. As many of you know, my life has not always been entirely a bed of roses. I have also experienced the pain of thorns. I have faced many health crises since childhood. But my father and mother have never let me feel that I have suffered. My father and mother have always stood by me. And my father and mother have always made me feel that if I can think, I'll do it. And I think that, that is what my father and mother mean to me. And uh, I am eternally grateful. Now I'll come to Radhika. I'm 100% the lucky one. There's no doubt about that. I also don't know how I got Radhika. So I am definitely the most uh, luckiest here. Uh, Radhika has been, uh, for the last seven years, it feels like I met Radhika yesterday. But every day I fall more and more in love. Like my brother-in-law says that when he used to see my sister, he had volcanoes and fountains going up in his heart. I would say I have earthquakes and tsunami is going in my heart when I see Radhika. So thank you Radhika for everything. Comprehensive biography of Anant Mukesh Ambani and detailed information about his wedding and his wife, Radhika Merchant. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the most fascinating stories and biographies of influential personalities from around the world. Today, we have a special episode lined up for you as we dive deep into the life of Anand Mukesh Ambani, the youngest scion of India's richest family, the Ambani's. We'll also take a closer look at his much-anticipated wedding to Radhika Merchant and get to know more about his charming fiancé. So, sit back, relax, and let's get started. The Early Life of Anand Ambani Anand Mukesh Ambani was born on April 10, 1995, into the illustrious Ambani family. He is the youngest son of Mukesh Ambani, the chairman and managing director of Reliance Industries Limited, and Nita Ambani, the founder and chairperson of Reliance Foundation. Growing up in Mumbai, Anand had a privileged upbringing, surrounded by luxury and immense wealth. However, despite his family's immense fortune, Anand was raised with strong values and a sense of responsibility towards society. Anand's education and personal development Anand attended the prestigious Dhirubhai and Bani International School in Mumbai, where he received his early education. His academic journey then took him to Brown University in Rhode Island, USA, where he studied liberal arts. 
The education he received at Brown played a crucial role in shaping his perspectives on business and management. It was during his time at university that Anand developed a keen interest in various fields, including technology, energy, and sustainability. Anand's role in Reliance Industries After completing his education, Anand returned to India to join the family business, Reliance Industries Limited, one of the largest conglomerates in the country. He is particularly focused on the group's new energy business, which includes initiatives related to renewable energy sources and sustainability projects. Anand's involvement in Reliance Industries signifies the next generation's active participation in steering the company towards a greener and more sustainable future. Entering the family business After completing his education, Anand, like his siblings, joined the family business. He has shown a particular interest in the energy and technology sectors of Reliance Industries. As of 2024, he was serving as a director on the board of Geo Platforms, the digital services arm of Reliance Industries that has revolutionized India's telecom sector. Anand has been involved in Reliance's new energy business, which aligns with his reported passion for wildlife conservation and environmental causes. In 2022, he was appointed to the board of Reliance New Energy Solar and Reliance New Solar Energy, marking his growing role in the company's green energy initiatives. Despite being born into immense wealth, Anand has shown a desire to make his own mark. In various interviews, Mukesh Ambani has praised Anand's passion and commitment to the business, particularly in the realm of new technologies and sustainable energy solutions. Anand's Personal Health Journey Anand's journey hasn't been without challenges. He has been in the public eye not only due to his family's prominence but also because of his personal health journey. Anand struggled with obesity for many years, and his significant weight loss transformation has been widely covered in the media. His journey involved rigorous exercise, a strict diet regimen, and immense determination. Today, Anand stands as an inspiration to many who face similar challenges, proving that with dedication and perseverance, one can achieve remarkable transformations. Introduction to Radhika Merchant, The Ambani Bride Now, let's shift our focus to the woman who has captured Anand's heart, Radhika Merchant. Radhika is the daughter of Aaron Merchant, the CEO of Encore Healthcare. She was born on December 18, 1994 into a well-established family with strong business connections. Like Anand, Radhika has a commendable educational background. She completed her schooling in Mumbai and then pursued higher education at New York University, NYU, where she studied politics and economics. Her education at NYU provided her with a broad understanding of global business and economic policies. Radhika comes from a prominent business family herself. She is the daughter of Viren Merchant, the CEO of Encore Healthcare, and Shaila Merchant. Radhika completed her schooling in Mumbai before moving to New York University for her higher education. Upon returning to India, she briefly worked with India First Organization, a think tank focused on national security and strategic issues. She also had a stint at Desai and Dewanji, a law firm. Despite her own accomplishments, Radhika has maintained a relatively low profile compared to the Ambani's. However, she has been spotted at various Ambani family events over the years, fueling speculation about her relationship with Anand long before their engagement was officially announced. Radhika is known to be a trained Bharatanatyam dancer, showcasing her connection to Indian classical arts. This aligns well with the Ambani family's known patronage of Indian arts and culture. Radhika's career and personal interests. Radhika is actively involved in her family business and has a keen interest in healthcare and pharmaceuticals. However, her talents and passions extend beyond the business world. Radhika is an accomplished classical dancer and has performed at various prestigious platforms. Her arranged track, the debut onstage performance in Barrett Navy, was a celebrated event attended by many prominent personalities, showcasing her dedication and love for the art form. Anant and Radhika's relationship and engagement. While the exact timeline of Anant and Radhika's relationship remains private, the two have known each other for several years. They were childhood friends who grew closer over time, with their families having known each other for over two decades. 
Their relationship first caught public attention when Radhika was seen performing at Isha and Bonnie's Sangeet ceremony in 2018. Since then, she has been a constant presence at Ambani family functions, slowly but surely becoming a part of the family. The couple's engagement was formally announced in January 2023, following traditional Gujarati rituals of Jyol Dana and Chanari Vidi ceremonies. These ceremonies, held at the Ambani residence Antilia, officially marked the union of the two families. Anant Ambani and Radhika Merchant have been long-time friends, and their relationship blossomed over the years. Their engagement was a grand affair held at the Ambani residence, Antilia, in Mumbai. The event was attended by close family members, friends, and several high-profile guests. The couple's engagement photos and videos were widely shared on social media, capturing the attention of fans and followers across the globe. The Pre-Wedding Extravaganza while the actual wedding date was not announced as of April 2024, the pre-wedding celebrations held in March 2024 captured global attention. The three-day extravaganza took place in Jamnagar, Gujarat, where Reliance Industries has a major refinery. The guest list read like a who's who of global elite, including tech moguls like Mark Zuckerberg and Bill Gates, politicians, Bollywood stars, and international celebrities. The event was a showcase of Indian hospitality and the Ambani's global connections. Day one of the celebrations focused on an evening in Everland, featuring a special drone show and a performance by Rihanna. The second day, themed a walk on the wildside, included a visit to the Ambani's Animal Rescue Center, highlighting Anand's passion for wildlife conservation. The final day, Hastakshar, was a celebration of Indian culture with traditional wear and cuisine. The scale of the celebrations was unprecedented. Guests were flown in on chartered flights and accommodated in luxury tents. The event featured performances by numerous international artists, creating a spectacle that dominated news cycles for days. Wedding Details and Preparations Now, let's talk about the most awaited event, Anand and Radhika's wedding. While the exact details and dates have not been publicly disclosed, it is expected to be a lavish and grand celebration, reflecting the Ambani family's tradition of hosting opera events. Here are some anticipated highlights of the wedding. The wedding is likely to be held at one of the Ambani residences or a luxury destination. Ceremonies The wedding will include traditional pre-wedding functions such as Sangi, Mehendi, and other cultural ceremonies. These events are expected to feature performances by renowned artists and elaborate decorations. Guest List The guest list will comprise celebrities from Bollywood, politicians, business tycoons, and international dignitaries. The Ambani family is known for their connections with high-profile individuals, ensuring a star-studded guest list. Security and Arrangements Given the prominence of the Ambani family, security will be tight, and the event will be meticulously planned and executed. High-end catering, designer outfits, and luxury decor are expected to be part of the celebrations. The Ambani Legacy and Future As Anand prepares to start this new chapter of his life with Radhika, he carries forward the legacy of one of India's most influential families. The Ambanis have shaped much of India's post-liberalization economy, and now, the third generation is poised to take this legacy forward. Anand's focus on green energy and technology aligns with global trends and India's push towards sustainable development. His union with Radhika, who comes from a business background herself, is seen as a merger of two forward-thinking families. While the couple's actual wedding date wasn't public as of April 2024, it was expected to be another grand affair, possibly surpassing even the pre-wedding celebrations in scale and grandeur. Conclusion and Closing Remarks As we look forward to this grand celebration, it's clear that Anant Ambani and Radhika Merchant's wedding will be one of the most talked about events in India. Both Anant and Radhika come from influential families and have significant roles in their respective family businesses. Their union is not just a celebration of love but also a convergence of business and social elites, their union is not just a personal milestone but an event of national interest in India, symbolizing the continuation of a business dynasty that has played a crucial role in shaping the country's economy. As we eagerly await more details about their wedding, one thing is certain, it will be an event to remember, 
blending tradition with opulence in true Ambani style that we hope you enjoyed this comprehensive biography of Anant Mukesh Ambani and the detailed insights into his wedding with Radhika Merchant. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories and biographies. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Follow the channel on social media platforms, stay tuned for more exciting content, and until next time, take care and stay curious.